In this 30th episode of the EdTech Shortcut podcast, we'll delve into designing accessible multimedia and interactive activities in the classroom. Welcome to the EdTech Shortcut podcast, your one-stop shop for innovative and practical tips, tricks, and tools to help you incorporate educational technology into your classroom. So let's get this episode started. Here is your host, Tristan Heron. Welcome back to the 30th episode of the EdTech Shortcut Podcast. And welcome back to creating accessible learning activities. In this episode, we'll delve into designing an accessible multimedia and interactive activity with these two handy hints. Tip number one, provide captions or transcripts for videos and audio recordings to ensure that students with hearing impairments can access the content. Platforms like YouTube or Microsoft Stream offer built-in captioning features that make it easier to create accessible videos for your classroom learning environment. Tip number two, design interactive activities with alternative navigation options, such as keyboard-friendly interactions to support students with motor disabilities. For instance, tools like Book Widgets or Quizlet allow customization of activities for different accessibility needs. Stay tuned for more practical tips on creating inclusive multimedia and interactive learning activities coming soon. Well, that's it for this 30th episode of the EdTech Shortcut Podcast. Make sure that you stay connected with the team from Evolve EdTech by connecting with us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Until next time, don't forget to keep innovating with EdTech in your classroom. Thanks for listening to this episode of the EdTech Shortcut Podcast with Tristan Heron. If you are looking for more tips, tricks, and tools to help you incorporate educational technology into your classroom, make sure you visit Evolve EdTech at www.evolveedtech.com. Thanks.